Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Bath 31 of Let's Play the March of the ET, where we are currently Under my marching, surprisingly enough. Um, stand upon let me just quickly pull my men into a position that makes Move some semblance of sense. Forward. Yes, pr quickly. Actually, no. My infantry can go down here. Move forward. Forward. Move. Keep up every time. Cavalry. Support attack. Infantry. All to move. All right, there we go. And I didn't mean to get off my horse. I wanted to uh, pull back so I could get a drink. Move on up. Hold arrows. Infantry. There we go, that should be fine. We'll send our spear toting infantry against the enemy cavalry. And our other cavalry our cavalry against the cavalry, and they should be fine. I apologize for how loud that ball was. I feel like this is going very well, personally. Cool. They are, of course, going to get reinforcements, but that really doesn't... Why do we have a fucking Bolton Flayer? We haven't even been off the continent. How the fuck have we got Bolton Flayers? Yeah. That is the one thing I am looking forward to, is getting off of the continent. So once we've con conquered Essos in, in earnest, and we added it to the uh, might of the Yeti Shogunate, we'll be able to invade King's Landing. Still really wish I hadn't implemented that rule. That's going to be a very painful rule for us. Having to take King's Landing first. It's not even painful because of anything other than the fact that it's it's just that it's King's Landing. It's just, just that likelihood of us taking King's Landing is... Uh, it's not going to be low. It's just we have to remember that it's not a simple... You know, we're not just taking King's Landing, you know? We're having to fight whatever, whoever the fuck has King's Landing as well. And make sure they don't have enough our men to stop me taking it. Or to start sieging me or start attacking me. And you know, basically we need to, you know, we need to know that we need to remember that they're going to attack us more than likely while we try and take it. At the moment, it's under the Stormlands, which Oh, Dragonstone's been destroyed again, which means fuck's sake. Oh, that means that uh, the Stormlands are stupidly powerful. Yep. I mean, don't get me wrong. I've still got loads to conquer until then. So we're st there's still, if we're completely honest, we're still very much more than likely going to be able to do it without probably too many issues. It's just annoying, you know? Yeah, if we can get Bisa, uh, Anogar, Lorath, and maybe the rest of their castles and just leave them with two cities, that to me will be uh, a good war but yeah I, I very much want bisa and anogar and I, i'd love to get laraf as well in this one war because it means that the next war we're like we've essentially done taking what we've taken out what would have been the laraf here the only difference is obviously they were it was uh these dipshits instead the bravos here uh, also this is probably going to be a actually decent fight because they have uh, a bunch of pies here now I could probably, I could probably just kill off the garrison, but only 102 of it is the garrison, so it really would not change much. Visa has already been added to our list of conquests, which is great. Um, you've got Axe Castle, but apparently they want, people want to give it to you, so let's give it to you. I mean, you don't like me still a little bit, which is honestly a little rude. I mean, I think I've done anything wrong to you, other than I defeated your nation, then I gave you a new one to play for. Like I get, it's like I I took your toys, but I gave you better toys. They want to make peace with Bravo, so can we uh got twenty hours to break the walls down. It took us sixteen hours. Um, screw it. 
we take this, and yeah, I guess we're not getting Lon I guess we're not getting uh, Lorafi, but or Loraf, but fuck it. We'll have taken a good amount. And realistically, we do need time to go get other stuff done, so. How the fuck am I not hearing them? They're like... I'm either... Oh, I'm, I'm... Somehow I underranged them. There we go. I say the sheer amount of them up there, it shouldn't be fucking hard to hit something. See? Slowly but surely. Yeah, we're not going to get our uh, thing up, uh, our athletics up if we just keep waiting, trying to shoot over here. We need to go inside and do some uh, sword fighting, I think, more than likely. But let's just waste the rest of our arrows on these idiots coming out. Because at the very least, we'll level up our bow, which is uh, still important to me. So at this rate, there's a lot of no, there's a lot of troops in here. This uh, we shouldn't be, we shouldn't have a problem actually getting in and having someone to fight. Now I know the other side flank is a lot typically a lot better to go in, but uh, oh well, I've already gone in this. We've already decided to go in this one. Now I know the Bravosi. Oh, you shit. Okay, I found a little bit of a slot I can shoot for a good. Let me waste the last of my arrows here. Fucking. Okay, we've got a. Not a we've got to not get pushed by my own troops, and I can. Uh... Okay, so there's like a height to it. So we can shoot at certain at like heights, but we can't. Like, once they get, but like, you know. They get a little bit too low. We, we ain't gonna be able to add, you know, insult to injury. Oh, wait a minute. Oh fuck! I thought that would work. Well, come on, in we go. I feel like my men are nowhere near aggressive enough sometimes. Right, my goal is before I get knocked out is to get my athletics to 200. Is it doable? I actually don't know, but we're gonna fucking try. I mean, my two-handed skill would probably be also be great to level up, but yeah, I really don't care about that right now. Yeah, athletics is definitely not doable. I don't think 200. Yeah, because I just, especially because I just got put in a situation where I could, yeah. I got it up by five, and I got no one-handed skill. How bad is my one-handed skill? I didn't realize my one-handed was that bad, to be fair. But apparently it is. Oh, wow. We actually failed getting in the back. That doesn't happen very often. Wait. Oh, no, we did try. We just legitimately failed. Way too many people got away. And as I can't fight Key Bell, and I don't want to, we'll just do that. Do you dickhead still one piece? You do. And congratulations. We have too many enemies, we literally have none. I, I feel like that game needs the game needs to stop trying to fucking uh make me think we have enemies when I know we don't. At the very least, we've prepared ourselves for a good next war. But we are going to now need a metric ton of troops. Um, yeah, I need way more archers. Let's, uh, let's just pick up a load of samurai archers. 
Now, apparently he's the one who gets it, so everyone else isn't uh, pushing as much as they could. Uh, let's just go... You know, fuck it, we'll go straight home and then we'll worry about building up stuff. I want to see how uh, our uh, capital is doing. The Ben Free, I swear to God, if you fucking... If you idiots die, I would actually be very upset with you. Well, Verena can't... Verena's... She's got 64. She hasn't got that many troops, but she's like... She should have enough. Pick up some more wood while we're here. Right. Decent amount of horses. Don't need horses as far as I know. So all that. So all that. Sell that. Beautiful. Uh, didn't want to trade. Actually, wait, was there any? Yeah, it was hardwood I didn't buy. Cool. Um, oh, I nearly leveled up. Awesome. Uh, you have leveled up. Get paid in promise. Go end of the smith here. Weirdly enough, that didn't level me up. A little insulted game, to be honest. Right. Uh, very quickly going to chuck those dipshits in there. There we go. Okay, that's looking like a lot healthier. Number 45 of them, see? A lot healthier. Huh, apparently they're all considered different swords, even though they're the fucking exact same. Cool, that's... A lot more annoying than you'd honestly ever expect, game, but uh, it's okay, I'll let you off. Right, so, uh, to do the one thing I came before, I know, again, before anyone says in the comments, I know I'm getting a lot of samurai, but honestly, we fucking need them. Like, it's been proven at every turn how much we need them. Also, having taken this, which, uh, actually, no, we need to take Laura, fuck. I was about to say, yeah, having taken this, we can now make Naginata Samurai Cav, but we can't because we haven't took Lorath, which is the fucking capital of those two. Bollocks. All right, we're back up to full. Oh, I did level up. Awesome. I'll put a point there, and then we'll put... I mean, I do need this up, but at the same time, I also don't. Putting you up just because I need to get control up. I could put an I could get control up as well, just to really, really get so I could like I could put it up one here and then put it up one more again. Um to be fair though, we're we're at least I think we're we need at least I think it's seven to get this up, or is it it's either seven or six to get this up to here? It's seven. So like we're we're gonna be a long away. You know what? Fuck it. I'm going to start building that up because we we need it. It's it's necessary. Uh, we're going to go do a bunch of selling now. Uh, the reason we're going to do that is because we want to bring in a couple more clans. Uh, I'm actually making a profit. So, oh, fuck. I also did the one thing. I, I also forgot to do the one thing I actually came back for. I also forgot to sell my prisoners as well, which would have probably been useful. Also, my download is done. Yay. Dawn Trail, here I come. You're probably thinking, Joe, what's Dawn Trail? And if you if you don't know what Dawn Trail that is, uh, Dawn Trail is the new expansion for Final Fantasy XIV, which is why I'm trying to get so much work done so I can basically just disappear from YouTube for a few days and play that to my heart's content. Um, you've spent quite a bit, and I, I feel like you haven't even done your fucking vacations yet. Jesus Christ, you suck. 
I'm glad I didn't make any like prosperity goals for this settlement because if I did, I would definitely not be hitting them. Because holy shit. I also kind of want to... Do you know what? I'm going to do something dumb. I'm going to chuck away all of that for 40,000 experience and just try and, you know, get myself back uh, up a little bit. Uh, hold on a minute. Let me just... You guys are easy. Um, 11 more of you. Uh, do that and then that. It gets us quite a lot more Nagnatic Samurai. Which are obviously going to hit like a freight train, which is good. And we're back to losing money. Makes sense. And I don't say makes sense sarcastically. Legitimately, makes sense. Um, I don't know if there's anything else. Yeah, I don't know if there's anything I need in here other than to sell this. And we'll lose a couple of grand on that. It really doesn't matter. So we've got... Quite a bit of money. You joined the enemy, and the other two I physically can't get to join me. Sanori. You hate me at minus 40, and you hate me at minus 45. Who else has been destroyed? Valentine. Don't know you, don't know you, so I can't pull you in. I already looked at Kahorik. I don't know why I went back to them. Fortunately, those guys have all popped up somewhere else. Yeah, biggest issue about the Mirish is I oh, I know you. Okay, we can bring that. We can bring at least a Mirish clan in. Lyseni. Uh, what about Lorafi? I mean, I could just go meet them. If you know, let's see how much money we can make. And if we can, if we make enough, we might just go around finding some new people to play, say, play with. Road tolls. Ah, uh, fuck it, fine. For once, I'm just gonna let it go because it's only it's only point two. I, 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 as much as I want to argue, that's not the worst take. You know. So, why not? Because I have a bigger sword that I can sell. Uh, by bigger, I meant more expensive, obviously. Uh, let's also... Get rid of all these for now, so I know how much meat we've got. This DF, let's get over there. Yeah, fighting against the Neris again is going to suck for us, obviously. But we also need to get ourselves a lot of mount because... We are, uh, we could definitely be doing with a lot more, um, you know, well, on men on, uh, hey, Fiddy, join us up, boys. That's, yeah, we're up to 15 clans now. The only people who have more, yeah, the North, and that's it, I think. I don't think anyone else has more than us. Oh, no, the Westlands do as well, that makes sense. Yeah, and the Reach is one off of us, so we are starting to match Westerosi powers in terms of how many fa uh, how many people we have. Um, but yeah, it's not going up quickly, mind you. Uh, d d I'll just sell three of those, I guess. And yeah, we have loads and loads of swords, so it's not going to be you know an issue in terms of money. We'll be fine. We will be absolutely fine. Lucas's army. Well, good for Lucas. All right. Yeah, buy everything we can. Buy some of you. You as well. Uh, again, any mounts. We don't need to buy war mounts. Oh, fuck it. We'll buy war mounts. Why not? Uh, wait, wait, wait. Did I just buy an expensive mount? Yes, I did. Go away. Uh, right. So we'll sell. Yeah, sell a bunch of the little, uh, the uh, cheaper swords. I mean, they sell well, so there's no reason not to. Uh, right. Buy 
say, do we need fish? No, we don't really need fish. Fish is like one of the few ones we don't need right now. Sell you. Okay, yeah, we probably, if we sell everything, we'll have enough money for a couple more clans. Which, if we think about it, probably, and by probably, I mean, I mean definitely, in our best interest to do so. Because again, the more clans we pick up now, the less chance they've got for having shit opinion of us, and for us to obviously have a problem with getting them into our nation later. Yeah, this city sucks. Yeah, Illyria, you're the only Valyrian city and you are shit. The rest, of course, are Giscari, which... I liked it better when there was four Valyrian cities. It was... it was just nice, you know? Um, yeah, we're slowly getting a little bit faster, which is good. 500 grand. Yeah, we're definitely going to have enough money to get these clans we need. Good. My goal is to just get every single clan I can get in the game to join me. Like, if people w are willing to join me, like, I want to be able to let them join. That's kind of like the goal. And the reason for that is not because, you know... Not for any, like, reason of, oh, I just want to have loads of clans. It's, I feel like it makes sense to, uh, like, get them all into our uh, empire. You know, if we're going to try and, you know, rule over their lands, it makes sense we kind of bring them in. Admittedly, the biggest issue is we physically can't give them the lands that they should have because, you know, we, well, it just wouldn't make sense. Because we, 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 to get them into our nation, we need to conquer them. But by conquering them, we then have taken their nation. But so by the time we've yeah, by the time we've taken them in, all their lands has been dis dispersed to someone else. Either way, the point still kind of stands, I guess. Oh, bunch of wood, good. Horses, Dornish horse. Don't need you. How many sumpters have I got? I can buy another four. Buy a bunch, I guess. Uh, so Horus. Let's see if we can get up to a million before we uh, do anything. I'd be lying if I said I don't think we can. I think I think we can. It just depends on how much uh, stuff we buy out as well. Quickly pop over here. Yeah, taking Volantis is going to be a very good boon for us. Just because it's four cities really close together. Taking Slaver's Bay is going to be great as well. And this is like the biggest thing. So we take over here, we are pretty much sorted when we go to fight elsewhere. The problem is, it's just not easy to take because obviously it's under control of very powerful people. Which is obviously making what makes sense. Uh, right. Yeah, we're actually not going to be able to get a million. Damn. What I get for keep buying stuff. Oh, well. Um, Someone's leveled up. It wasn't me. Well, that's a big shame. Uh, You've leveled well. Not only have you leveled up, you've also got the ability to get even better at that. Well done, lad. Uh, While we're doing this, let's make sure we pick up all the wood. We'll go drop it off. Uh, Just because we may as well, if we're over here, we may as well buy the wood, you know? going to be necessary to my grand plans in the future again every because every time we're going to have to take little breaks just to make sure we've got uh you know everything we need and i mean why the fuck not am i right all right so we'll get you get on you it's no Bloody things we need here. Uh, whatever. Uh, yep. Yeah. Wow, we have a sword left. In all fairness, we were pretty close to a million. So we'll go drop off the wood in our capital, and then after that, we're actually going to uh, hop down to wherever these... Uh, unless they're obviously in Westeros, in which case we're kind of fucked because they're in Westeros and I can't go over there, but we're going to do our best to get ourselves... Um, I also still haven't bought the fucking workshops in my head. Okay, first things first, we're going to go buy the workshops here. Then we're going to go drop... We're going to drop all our wood and buy the workshops here. Then we're going to go try and find the Mirish clan. Hire two of them. 
preferably two, maybe one, we'll see. And then from there, we're going to, uh... Uh, I don't know what we're going to do after that, but uh, first thing, let's just buy all this crap. Yeah, don't care, give me the tannery. Now, is this a smart choice in terms uh -huh. of, like, are they going to be worthwhile? Probably not, but we're buying them for the simple fact of they're in my Can land. Introduce... Like, buying them because they're in my land is the best option, you know? Right, so let's recruit. We don't need to recruit anything. Let's go to the keep. Well, actually, first. We may as well go to the smithy and get them all turned into um, beautiful and usable charcoal. We now have over a thousand charcoal, looking good. Right, we're done here. We did spend quite a bit of money. Right, Mirish clans. You, where are you? Weirdly enough, you're actually a bit closer than I was expecting. But before we end the part, we're going to go hire him. Don't know who the fuck that is, but uh, the clan, not an actual faction, so... Weirdly enough, not a problem. Right. I don't know if that's him, but... That's close enough. Who are you? Weirdly enough, that is the... Oh, that's perfect. Render Grand, can did continue it. Consider it done. He was the strongest of them. The next was uh, you. Over by Novros. So that guy's actually in our territory already. Um, You guys... Yeah, we'll just pull you guys to my, me as well. Because we're going to be going to war pretty soon anyway. And uh, we're going to be finishing off Bravos. Taking back Lorath. And uh, sweeping up as much of this territory as we can in the next war. The good thing is we should also be able to give Lorath back to the, Lor the Lorathi as well. Uh, Varina. That's this bitch. Congratulations! You're sucking less at this now. Still kind of sucking, but bless. All right. Still apparently near Novros. Okay. Just had to check. I don't know if you're the leader. Right. So who might you be then? Very well. Right. So there we go. We've now spent all of my money. And let's go actually prepare. We're going to go over here and prepare. And I guess, you know, it's time, probably a good idea to bring some more troops in. Only cheap ones, preferably. Basically, anything under 20 and, you know, it's good enough. There we go. We'll go, there we go. We'll spend 200 influence on getting the, uh, getting an army ready. And we'll actually go chill here. But until the next part, I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did enjoy, please do follow me on YouTube. Leave a like, leave a comment, leave a share. But most importantly, guys, stay safe. Have a great day. Join the channel membership if you're interested. And I'll see you all in the next one. See you guys then.